We're gonna use our ladder drills to try and build concepts to becoming better lacrosse players. Our first concept that we're gonna try and ingrain is gonna come from the in and out, out drill in the ladder. This drill is designed to force your feet to stay underneath your body. Wasted movement is going to lead to lack of performance on the field. Doesn't matter how fast you are, if you're stepping in the wrong direction, or even more so, stepping outside that cylinder of your body and you're on the turf. Now, we're gonna do the in and out, out drill with tons of progression. My goal every time we train is to make our athletes feel uncomfortable. So they're gonna start with the in and out, out, ingrain that concept of feet underneath their body, but as soon as they get good, we're gonna adjust things, just like the game. It constantly changes, whether we're going on movement, whether we're going on reaction, whether we're sprinting, cutting, turning, we're gonna try and alter this every single time we do it to keep our athletes kind of on the edge. Now, a big problem with ladder drills, a lot of people train to get better at the ladder drill itself. We're trying to get better at the concept and use it as a tool to get better on the lacrosse field. So the first drill we're gonna do here is an in and out, out drill. The number one concept of this drill is keeping your feet underneath your body. I don't care how fast you are, if you're not taking calculated steps, you're not gonna make plays. Those feet need to be underneath our body. If that foot comes too far front, the angle in which you're gonna push off of is either gonna cause you to slide or obviously you're going in the wrong direction, you're not gonna make a play. That's the same thing with a fall step or a drop step behind you. That foot's gonna slip out, it's gonna send you in the wrong direction. So with this in and out, out drill, our fellows are gonna go through making sure we're nice and low, sinking in our hips, our chest is proud, our eyes are up. We're trying to train vision here as well. I want those eyes up, but really I want them to see everything. I want them to take a snapshot of the ladder. I want them to see in front, right, left. Vision is one of the most underrated parts of a sport. If we can train the vision, we're gonna become better players. So we're here leading with that front foot, in, in, out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in, out, out. Now the gentlemen are gonna be holding their sticks. That's gonna be a sport specific stick position. We wanna make sure that we're relaxed. We wanna make sure that we're thinking about playing the game, trying to ingrain this concept into when we're on the field. You could face me, we're gonna go through. Once the person in front of you gets about four holes, next person can go. I want it at nice slow tempo. Ready, go ahead. Small steps, good. That You could see that that trail leg came back a little bit further. You want that foot right underneath, excellent. Good, stay relaxed, make sure we have those sticks. Good, out in front, good, nice and low. Good, 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 stay relaxed, stay relaxed, stay relaxed, excellent. Good. Now obviously we're gonna do that both ways. Here's the deal, going in one direction isn't really gonna help us. We wanna make sure that we play the game. The game is 360 degrees. So now we're gonna progress to where we go on call. I'm gonna have two athletes anchor the ladder at the top and bottom. I'm gonna have two athletes in the middle. Now again, we wouldn't progress to this until we master the technique of just going through, but more so the concept of going through of feet underneath our body. We're gonna get two or three guys in the middle. They're gonna be nice and low. They're gonna go off of my verbal call. When I say right, they're gonna to move to the right. When I say left, they're gonna to move to the left. They wanna make sure that they're exaggerating that depth. With more movement and transition, you need to make sure that you're low. So the lower, the better here. We're gonna go on my voice. Right, left, feet underneath. Right, watch, we're reading, reading with the incorrect foot there. Left, right, front foot leading, front foot leading, and relax, good. Now you saw we got caught up sometimes leading with the trail foot. What that's going to simulate is a crossover step. This is not an athletic position. If you get caught there, a strong wind's gonna put you on the butt, you're not gonna be making plays. The next two gentlemen can move in. Now, my goal is to make this just as hard as the game. Part of the game is reacting with your eyes. So our next progression here is gonna be going on my hand signals. When I point here, they're gonna go to the right. When I point here, they're gonna go to the left. I don't expect them to stare at me. I expect them still to see everything. So they need to see the ladder, they need to see me, they need to play the game and take that big picture. Ready? Good, that's it, excellent, good posture. Good, way to fix that. Front foot always leading, stay low. Front foot, front foot, front foot. Good fix and relax, excellent. Good work, gentlemen, good work. 